great people, great people, great people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom are great people. I am back again today. We are moving forward. We are not going to move back an inch on this Biafran restoration project. We are born for this. We don't listen gossip. We say things the way it is and nothing will happen. That is the way it is. My great people, I welcome you all today. I still remain the Biafran child in watching like a Mazo Kichukun. The general, I am from Ihala in Anambra. Anambra in Biafra land. I am under, I am IPOB under chain of command. DOS is the highest office of this movement. At the Mazin Namdekano is the highest commander. For some of you that are asking who is the highest authority, it's our leader, Onyendu Mazin Namdekano. And IPOB is our family. These three things that I mentioned, we must defend them jealously. Now pay attention to this. I have a particular message to some particular people. They are living today in America. You know, when all this thing just started, in when you are telling them Hana PC Akabaka, they tell you it's lies. Is this now Ofugo Fananya? They are seeing it koro koro. There is no how they can dispute it because now it's happening. And I want our people to understand that we have fought this war and that we have won it. Today, all of them they are running heter scatter. The division have come among them within seven to eight months. And I want you people to understand when this IPOB, when Mazen Nam, they cannot put this IPOB in place. But those side of people, within even under one year, they have scattered. That to show you that we are in on this Biafran restoration project. Like I always tell my people, I don't have what it takes to give you Biafran. That is why I will keep on following the leadership, which is DOS, led by Mazen Chiki, Dozim, they are the people. That is why I always make sure that I follow their footsteps. And that is the structure that our leader put in place. C and C, command and control. Don't be in subordination. Now they begin to see it, Kuro Kuro. It's happening in front of them. There's no how they can dispute it. Because it's out there in public domain. We told them, but they don't want to listen. Now they have found out there is a problem everywhere. They are beginning again with their propaganda. Now they have come again with propaganda. And that's something that I want to tell our people today. I'm not saying it because I am the one that said our leader have mentioned in town with that number. This IPOB movement started here in Europe and it will end here in Europe. Those of you that in America, I am sending this message direct to those that are coming again with propaganda, deceit, brainwash, siphon our people. But I am here to sanitize them. Like I said, this message is direct to those in America. Our leader went there to tell them to join us. Because this Biafra that we are looking for, it's not for individual, it's for collective. Our leader went there and visited them. Now they join, and now they want to bring problem into this struggle. And they have been doing this from day one. Today, you have opened in their eyes. I mean, on their, they have seen everything live as they play. Now, they brought another propaganda. I am sending this message to AJRC. AJRC and his group or his co. AJRC, don't bring another propaganda. Don't bring another thing here. We don't care. We have left you people. You people should go out there and do whatever you people want. And leave IPOB and the leadership alone. Because when we are, we are saying this thing from the beginning, none of you believe. Now you people are asking for peace. That Onyendu said, this is how you people will keep on brainwashing people. Onyendu said that uh, there should be a peace. Now let me ask you people a question. After we have defeated everybody, after we have defeated every one of them, we have put them today in the trash. If you haven't listened, or if you haven't heard it, go now and see what Mazinelli is saying about one other Simon Eber. 
all the whole umwada that they were together from the beginning after the adoption of our leader all of them have been you know they have tear into pieces nowhere to be found the last the last one that remaining was Mazinelli and the one other simon Eba. now we have put them in that situation we have been waiting for a long time ago now we have started you see what we are saying we are in this struggle and we are not going to stop no one can stop us we are fighting for something that belongs to us it's our human right to ask what belongs to us like i said before to my people biafra was there before they came so this message i'm sending now the one they have done is enough the one they have you know all this problem they have caused to the leadership is enough we don't need anything from them we don't need their gossip anymore this is also how they want to put me on the middle on the on the road going back is not easy going forward is not easy that is exactly what is happening to simon today do you people remember the cause of all this problem they went to masichina samuru he rejected them they went to simon Eba. he accepted it you see he accepted it no problem if you can be able to take over that is exactly what they want to promise me i should come and take deputy tomorrow they, they will just left me and left me no place i can't find myself anymore and i said no who am i who am i to be in position of deputy there's a lot of people there before there's a lot of people they are in this struggle for a long time they are part of dos why me because you people have seen my activities want to enter the doctor more busy and you people are happening to yourself then I begin to wumbling around. AGRC, I am telling you, those people that are coming from America, this is their new propaganda they brought out again. They say that Onyendu told them that we should unite. Another propaganda. Because there is a war between Simon and the Mazinelli. Because that is the last final battle. It's going to happen in front of us and we are going to see it kuru kuru and it's happening right now as i'm speaking to you people they are beginning to question themselves that is the work we have done when all these things were happening a lot of these people now they are saying that only said there should be a unity among them they should call them back they should do this they were there when all these things started they were there they did not believe on this leadership at all they did not now all of those people that came as a wind wind have also blow them for blow them off now they begin to see it that none of them can stand that is only we are standing today now they bring another propaganda now let me ask a jersey and co or those people in america like i said our leader said this struggle started here in europe if you people like you want to join oh no, no i like when i gather because we are fighting for our own for all of us when it will happen it will happen also to every one of us this is how it is this struggle is something that we don't beg people you don't have to beg anyone sometimes some people will say i'm doing my work i'm doing what i have to do to make sure that i support the biafran restoration the well-being of our people now you people have heard what is flying on the air today we don't respond to those that we don't know what they are talking about i am telling a jason stop this your concocted story stop this fabricating lies that you are bringing out here you are telling us that only do said there should be a peace all this why when all these problems started when did this problem just began none of you come out and tell us hey una, tu, you, ni, ni, all this thing that you people are saying is true let us know how to put this thing to stop it to make it amicable so that we will move forward none of you none of you none 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 now all of them have failed as the the wind blow them come the same how the wind blow them off now you people begin to understand that we are 
those people that are ready to do anything possible to make sure that Biafra comes by propagating this issue, by keep on creating an awareness, keep on writing letters and tagging those that they are important in the international community. We are doing what it takes. Because today, there is a media. And uh, when they were calling that onion, do send them. Who send them? From where they get the letter? You see, our people, they always so, they love to lie. E jase, and go. Obwezi, all of them put together. But Obwezi, all of them put together. When all this thing started, do you know what you people were saying before? Do you know people? What, now you people are asking for peace. Now, how did that peace want to come? After we have defeated all of them. Now, let me ask you people a question. But we, I know, I know that it can never be happened. Such a thing can never happen. I know. I'm quite sure that they can never do it to defeat IPOB. It's impossible. They will try their best. But at the end, they will fail woefully. As they, were fa as they are failing today, they have failed. That is a problem everywhere. Now you people were there when all this thing started. For instance, or let me put it in that form, that IPOB leadership collapsed. Because we have to tell ourselves the truth. We are in this struggle, we tell you how it is. These people get to a point that even though me myself was wondering what is going on within our people, what is going on, that they get to extend that people say that these people are, are, are they, they know what they are doing. But we are there challenging them, telling them it can never happen as far as we are here. Nobody can ever take our food away from us. That is why we keep on countering them, talking to them, debunking them, telling them all this thing that you, you people are seeing today, Mazinelli say, we have said all this thing about Simon Eber six, seven months ago, that he is nobody, he is just nobody, no career at all, just a defrauding people, nothing else. Now they begin to tell you, now you begin to listen. You see, we have to understand the common letter. Now I'm asking a GRC, or with him, and those people in America that say that Onion Blue said that a peace will come. And how many of them will be that peace? How many of them they have to bring back? If it's like this leadership failed, where are you people going to start now calling the leadership to settle the case? Now you people want to be crying when the dice is already off. You are crying when you have already played your dice. You see what I'm talking about? That is some things that our people have to understand. If this leadership collapsed since all this while and all this thing was happening, and later you people realize that those side of people, they are also nobody. How can you call the leadership today to reconcile when every individual of them will be on their own today, trying to do their own business? Forget about Biafra. How will you people now, Owefi and the EJRC and those people in America, how will you begin now to call for peace? That is what I'm asking. How can you call for peace? And again, another question that I want to ask. When you people are talking about calling for peace, let us come back again. Because you people have the money. You people think that you people have the money. That without you people, nothing will happen. You people raise more funds than other people. That is what you people are thinking. But you people never know that this struggle that we are. Shuko Kikabiyama is the one piloting this struggle. You people are basing on, on money side. Eh, if we don't give you money, not. Today, you people are coming back again. Saying that Onyendu says we should, we should, we should, we should unite. Unite with who? If this movement collapsed since that seven months up to date, who and who are you going to call to sit or to begin to ask for, let us come back? Who are you going to call? That is my question to you people. The leadership was there before you people joined this struggle. And now you people came from backyard. 
want to overthrow everybody. The same thing you people want to do to me, to put me on the road. They teach you also the way Simon is teach today. Simon is on the road. Going back is not easy. Coming back, again, there is no how. Going front and come, no easy. Because all those people that we are with Simon, all of them that have left him, Simon is alone today. That is exactly what they want to do to me. Exactly. Mobile, uh, power tosso. I will just support them. Uh, probably, maybe, uh, who knows? They may say, okay, we announce this uh, beer franchise as a deputy. Now they will begin to use me to begin to do evil. Use my name now to be starting doing evil. That is exactly what. Because they know who they will go to. And by the end, I will be on the road. I cannot go back. I cannot go front. I will just, I will just stop there. And our people will begin to call me all sort of names. But believe, believe you me, we are learned people. We are learned people. We understand how they struggle move. Because we pay attention attentively and listen to every single word coming from our leader and the leadership. That is why we'll be able to sustain up to date and stick on that leadership. Now, my last question to those people in America both to with you, both to adjust you, both to all of them, both to uh, uh, rabbit chasso, all of them put together. Both to Oliver, all of them put together. I'm asking them now. They are saying that we only need to give a message that we should unite. Now, who are who going to? Or is it? Are they going? Are we going to bring Nelly too? Are we going to bring uh, Bridget too? Are we going to bring Goibo too? Marzinelli, are we going to bring him? Simon by himself is not part of us from the day one. All those Clifford, Iruan, are we going to bring them? Kafia, uh, Omiomi, are we going to bring them? Waiting with that woman, this woman, I have forgotten his name, her name, I mean to say. Are we going to bring her back again? All those people that have already deviated, are we going to call them back? So if you are asking for 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 let us uh, uh, make peace. Even I may work in Libya, Obi Ade Amma. Obu the same thing we are asking today in that contraption. Common president, they would they want they don't want to give you. Common president, you are among three tribes. Ibo Yoruba Awosa. But today, since 19, 19, uh, 1960, from independent up to date, an Igbo man never stepped his foot. As a president, forget about the one of Jonathan. Good luck. Now today they are using him. Now you understand. Now you understand. You are not part of them. Now do you understand? On a mega that you are not part of them. Now you are begging. You are running like a he goat, following Fulani everywhere, begging them, kneeling down to them to give you presidency that you are not going to be in control of. Now you understand. A G R C. Obuefi, Oliver, uh, Rabbit Chas, and, and all of you based in America, concocting story, fabricating lies every day, every everywhere, dishing out all deceit from your mouth everywhere. I'm asking you, all those people that I mentioned their name, are they going to come back? Are they going to come back? <laughs> you see, we have to understand the, I mean, what it takes whenever you want to go against or be in subordination you have to always think the implication before you start let me repeat what i said my question to those people living in america my question to them especially ejasi obuefi rabbit chas all of them put together. Oliver will be, will be Oliver something. Oliver will be, yes. Oliver. Let me put him Oliver. Before I make a mistake, put another surname. Oliver and all of them put together. Where were you people when all these things started? Why you people never call for peace and join the leadership and for these people so that it will be very easy for us? You people were there. As we are fighting those that are coming to destroy you people are also they are fighting dos 
I mean, DOS is taking, you know, you know, they are taking punches from left and right. These people are the other side. Nelly, they are the other side. Umwana, they are the other side. People in America, they are the other hitting one particular group of people. Let me ask you people, if this, if that group, if you people destroy that group that time, and today, those people, you, you people thought that they were doing well, disappointed you people today, who and who are you people going to call to come and make peace now? This is what I'm asking. That is my question. Simple one. Simple one. If it's like today, Mazi Chike Dozium resigned. Say, I'm not doing again, anything again. I'm just tired. Mazi Shinas and Woro resigned. Adan Nen Nayanya resigned. All of them from A to Z. All of them put together. I'm sorry to be calling some name. I'm not supposed to call him because I don't know all of them. I'm not part of the leadership. Okay, I'm not part of the leadership. So I want to, if all these DOL just resign, say we are tired, we are not going to do all this thing again. Who and who are you going to be calling today or to be talking to, telling him that peace should come? Who? Who? Now because you people have understood and they have gotten into your scores that Mazinelli now is on mission to finish Simon Eba, the remaining one. Now you people are now saying, you people receive message from Onyindu to make peace. This is what I'm asking. And now, second one is, who and who are we making peace with? I mean the leadership. When I'm saying I, I'm not part of the leadership, so you people will get me right. Because I'm part of IPOB, under oath. So, when I'm calling we, in general, the whole IPOB, but we have leadership. Who and who do you want us to make peace with? Are you going to bring Clifford Iruana? Are you going to bring Gomiomio? Are you going to bring Gushoka for me for? Are you going to bring a uh, African rep, which is uh, I've forgotten his name when I remember I'll call him? Are you going to bring a uh, uh, Jack from Coastal Region? Are you going to bring a uh, Omiomio? Are you going to bring the Leofebu Oibo? Madam Erewa, are you going to bring them back to make peace? Because uh, when you say something, you have to think about it. Don't think only about yourself. That means that we have to make peace with everybody. Now you understand. We will make peace with anybody, everybody. Now you are asking for peace. You will go and call them. Go and call all of them. We are want to make peace. Or shall you go draw? You are looking for peace. Now, we want to tell you, I want to tell you people, make una say una own. Make una day una lane, they do what una they do. You say una, una say una they support Biafran restoration. Biafran restoration. Make una they do and for a side. Now, wait till they talk. I'm not coming here to tell you that uh, you should not move forward in what you are doing. But I forget about all this piece you are talking about because all these people that have mentioned their name, you have to call them back. You have to bring them back. So if you cannot bring all of them back, make una day on a lane. They on a lane, they do what you know they do as soon as they fight for struggle. Make una they fight them, it's not a problem. Stop, stop disturbing people. Stop bringing fake news. Stop propagating evil. Propaganda everywhere. Stop it. It's not going to help us. You people should go and rethink and use una brain. Una COVID is not COVID. Can they go and see this? Una America, they have that now. America, they have to see all It's lie. The agitation started here in Europe. That is what our leader said. And it will also end here. If we like, we are here. We are nice. Make we carry on a peace, they go. Well, make we go join Simon Eba, Nelly Mazi, Nelly Ofewu. You people should go and join Simon Eba, Nelly Ofewu, Bridget, Oyibo. Go and join them. They have collapsed. How that go? How that I told Simon. I told him that this thing that he want to start, he can never finish it. I told him, I tried to reach him, but he came out on public domain, begin to rant, talk all sort of rubbish from his mouth that he don't want to talk to me. Today, all of them are descending on him. Now you understand. No two ways about it. On this quest of self-determination, we are moving forward till we restore our dignity and motherland called Biafra. That is modus, our modus operandi. 
to restore Biafra. Now you understand. Good.